I'm Alice Cade and I'm a member of Folk Dance Remixed um, and we are a company of folk and hip hop dancers. I've been asked to do this online video, a bit of a taster of some of our, our steps that we do and um, a chance for you to learn some of them and have a bit of a jam with them. We're going to learn a bit of step dancing, we're going to learn some bit of musical spoons, so get your spoons ready a pair per person um, and we're going to put them together and jam a little bit at the end. Step dancing is found all across the world and in many different walks of life. Even canal boaters had their own step dancing. Dancing to the beat of the engine, a Bollinger engine. Bangers and mash, bangers and mash, bangers and mash. So the first phrase we're going to learn is a body percussion phrase. It goes, it's got stamping, it's got clapping, it's got some posing, some fancy clapping and a shunt. Okay, so step one, we're going to do two stamps and a clap. Here we go. Stamp, stamp, clap. Stamp, stamp, clap. With me, stamp, stamp, clap. Excellent. Keep that going. Brilliant. You've got it. Excellent. Now, the next bit. We're going to do a big pose like this, lot of attitude, a proper pose with our arms crossed like that, like a sailor. So dropping down into our pose with our arms crossed. Excellent. Give it a bit more attitude, bit of a lean. Brilliant. Bending your knees. That's your pose. Make sure you're happy with your pose. Great. From there, you're going to hit the back of your hands together. Give that a go. Like a flying bird. Brilliant. So this is the move you're doing with your arms. Give that a go. Brilliant. So we've got our pose. Hit the back of the hands and down. Yes. So that's three beats. First three beats, putting that together, we've got stamp, stamp, clap. We're going into our pose. Pose, hit, down. Yes. Brilliant. So we've got one last thing to put on the end, and that is a shunt. So give it a go, a bit of a shunt. A shunt is shifting forwards without lifting your feet off the ground. Shunt, shunt. And you bend your knees to make that happen. Shunt. Give that a go. Excellent. So all of that together, we have stamp, stamp, clap, pose, up, down, shunt. Again, stamp, stamp, clap, pose, up, down, shunt. Stamp, stamp, clap, pose, up. Down, shunt, stamp, stamp, clap, pose up, down, shunt. Brilliant. Should we try that with music? So let's build the tempo of that up a little bit. Counting you in. Five, six, seven, eight. We've got stamp, stamp, clap. Have you got that? Brilliant. The next bit, we've got pose and pose. Pose and pose. Pose and pose. Great. Putting them together, we've got a stamp, stamp, clap, drop, up, drop, shunt. Stamp, stamp, clap, drop, up, drop, shunt. Stamp, stamp, clap, drop. <laughs>
The next thing I'd like to teach you is a little phrase using the musical spoons. So first of all, how to hold them. You want two that are the same or very similar, ideally. One of them you put upside down like this and you're going to put, make a pinch, a nose pinching sort of fingers with one hand. You put the upside down spoon in that so that it's resting on the fleshy part of your finger there. Excellent. The end, the other end, is in your hand, clasped in your hand. You're holding that spoon. The other one goes so back to back. You put it in the gap here that you've made and rests on the top of the fleshy bit of your first finger. So that is a hinge which is going to make a sound. So you put your thumb on top of that there. You're holding the top spoon loosely and the bottom one tight. So once you've got that, if you just try, they should hit together when you hit them on something. Excellent. Now you want to get your thigh. We're going to do this on our thighs. So we've got, we're going to make a beat like that. Tapping the spoons together. You might need to uh, adjust a little bit where you put the spoons, hold them so they're comfortable and just practice that. There we go. If you don't get a beat at first, it doesn't matter. This is something to keep trying. We've got a beat. Now we're going to make one more beat by hitting at the top as well. So we put our hand above our thigh and we're going to hit down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Just like that. Excellent. So, our rhythm that we're going to learn has this beat through it all. And we're going to, it, the rhythm goes, I, <laughs> the rhythm goes, I want some ice cream. I want some ice cream. So, that is, I want some ice cream, I want some ice cream. Excellent. So to recap with the spoons, just adjust them in your hand so you know you're making a noise with them. Excellent. And we've got a beat going on our leg like this. Okay, and we're going to add our hand over the top into this beat. So we've got leg leg, hand, leg, 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 hand, leg, leg. Keep it going. Leg, leg, hand, leg, leg. Excellent. So, one way I remember what the rhythm sounds like is by thinking, I've got a spoon here. I want some ice cream. I want some ice cream. I want some ice cream cream with me. I want some ice cream. I want some ice cream. I want some ice cream. Excellent. Fantastic. Let's do that with some music. going to learn is a little phrase from folk dance remix show step hop house again it doesn't matter which leg you do it on start on um, mirror me copy me whichever you fancy let's give it a go so we're going to start with digging our heel in twice on one side excellent give that a go dig your heel in twice so you're making a noise with your heel 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 excellent so the next bit we're going to add a hop step after that. So we've got heel, heel, hop, step. Yeah? From the top. We've got heel, heel, hop, step. Yeah, once more. Everybody ready? Here we go. 
kneel, heel, hop, step. Excellent. We're going to do exactly the same thing on the other side. The other foot ready. We've got a heel, heel, hop, step. On the other side again, we've got heel, heel, hop, step. Great. So let's put those two sides together. First side getting ready. We've got heel, heel, hop, step. Heel, heel, hop, step. Keep repeating this. Let's practice. Heel, heel, hop, step. Heel, heel, hop, step. This move is called a cowboy. Heel, heel, hop, step. Heel, heel, hop, step. Excellent, excellent. Have you got that? Brilliant. So we've done two cowboys, one on one side and one on the other side. We're then going to go up on one hill, the other hill, and then back down. So we go up on one hill, up on the other hill, back down. Give that a go. This is walking the plank. Up, up, down, down. So we go up, up, down, down. I'm really going up on my heels and back down. Balancing on my heels, back down. Up, up, back down. Excellent. Putting those two together, we have our cowboys first. Heel, heel, up, down. Heel, heel, up, down. One, walk the plank. We go from the top. Here we go. Heel, heel, hop, down. Heel, heel, hop, down. And walk the plank. Excellent. Once more. Heel, heel, hop, down. Heel, heel, hop, down. And walk the plank. Great. The next move, we're going to do a crisscross. Now, crisscross. It's a street dance move and you just basically cross, jump your legs crossed and jump your legs back. Here we go. So we cross, jump our legs crossed and jump our legs back. Let's try that a few times just to get the hang of it. We've got a criss, cross, criss, cross, criss, cross, criss, cross. Excellent. From the top putting all of those together, the cowboy, walking the plank and crisscross, we have cowboy and down, heel, heel and down, and walk the plank, crisscross. After our crisscross, we're going to do a move called a twist it. So twist it, you're going to go up on one heel and one toe. And you, just like that, one heel, one toe, twisting up. So you're really twisting your body, right down, twist up like that. So one foot is going out like that, and the other foot is going in like that, both at the same time. So we've got twist it, twist it. Excellent. So with the crisscross, that is crisscross, twist it. Give that a go. Here we go. Crisscross, twist it. Excellent. From the top. So from the top, we have heel, heel, and down, heel, heel, and down. Walk the plank and down. Crisscross, twist it. And we can do that again. Here we go. Heel, heel, and down. Heel, heel, and down. Walk the plank, and down. Crisp, cross, twist. Excellent. Are we ready? From the two heels. Five, six. Chris. 
done for going with me on those three snippets of phrases from our show. Um, you might not get all of them, you might have a favourite, you might um, really want to do all of them. Um, but now's our chance to really jam with these newfound skills. Now, we've learnt some spoons, we've learnt some body percussion and we've learnt some house folk steps. Now we're going to layer them up, adding one on top of the other and all make music together. Choose which one you want to do. We're going to, with the track, we're going to um, start with the spoons. We're going to add in the body percussion and layer up with the house folk one to end up all jamming together. Here we go. Okay, spoons are going to kick the rhythm off with our I want some ice cream rhythm. With the music, here we go. Ready and I. Excellent, keep that going. We're going to do the body percussion. so glad you could join us online today um, I hope you enjoyed learning and jamming along with us um, do revisit this video and keep playing um, and keep dancing and experimenting with stepping and playing the spoons um, that's all happy Easter everybody goodbye <laughs>